Templates in Figma Buzz are now more powerful and flexible. By using component properties in your assets, teams can now switch layouts like vertical or horizontal framing and toggle elements like logos and illustrations, all without detaching or breaking your templates. And yes, their content edits stay right where they are. Now that templates can be powered by component sets and properties, you can browse layout options and customize assets directly in Buzz. Once you insert a template, click Change Layout to open a new panel on the right. This shows all the layout options in the template set, organized visually for easy browsing. You'll also see a Customize tab. This is where any available components will show up as toggles or dropdowns, depending on how the template was built. This allows you to make layout and template changes without having to reinsert the asset. Let's say that you started with this layout here and you updated the text and then realized that you'd prefer a vertical framing instead. Instead of reinserting the template and copy and pasting, you can just switch layouts and all my content edits are gonna stay in place here. It's flexible and still fully on brand. You can speed up your workflow by updating content in one layout, duplicating the asset, and using Change Layout to create the different variations you need for your campaign, all right here. If you have an asset already built in Figma Design, in the right-hand panel, you can click Create Template Set. You'll now see an outline around the set. You can rename the set to keep things organized. By default, one variant property is created. Let's rename this one Season and label all of the options Winter, Spring, Summer, and Fall. From there, you can add more properties for layout, color, or size. To make this template even more dynamic, I'm gonna add a Boolean property to toggle the logo. I select the logos across all the assets, bind the property, and now it's exposed as an on-off toggle when used in Buzz. Now, once our component set is configured here, you can right-click and select Send to Buzz, or just copy and paste them into a new Buzz template file. Your component properties, variant swaps, booleans, and instance swaps will all carry over. You can also create template sets in design mode in Figma Buzz or use it to make any final tweaks or additions. You'll see your properties over here. Once your template sets are configured with properties in Buzz, you're ready to publish. Use the share menu to publish the template. Before rolling it out, test it yourself. Try the combinations and make sure all your swaps and toggles are working as expected. If you need to tweak something, just go back to design mode, make your changes, and republish. When you republish a template set, any templates currently in use will display an Update Available CTA, like you see here. Your teammates can select Review Updates to see a visual comparison of what's changed, and from there, they can choose either to accept or ignore the changes. For more details on how to create component sets with properties, check out the description where we break down components and variants in more detail. There's a lot to learn there. To try it yourself or follow along, check out the Figma Buzz Playground template file or use the same template from the Figma community.